What's up, everybody? Now, you might be asking yourself, what is going on here? What in the world is this guy doing on Helion server? This is a dead server. No one plays it. Why in the world would I be making a video on Helion server? Well, I had kind of a busy weekend uh, running around doing a lot of things. Um, and I checked my Discord earlier and I saw this. I saw uh, a message from Cedric. Uh, bring this to your attention. Helion server integration schedule and policy. Huh. So, yes, this is uh, this is finally happening. They are going to be merging uh, Trieste and Helion server together. So, uh, a lot of people have been waiting for this for a long time. Uh, if you would have asked me if I would have wanted this, uh, like back when Helion server was new, I would have said, no, 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 no. Please let Helion server do its own thing. But with how low the population is and the fact that Helion server is pretty much completely dead, uh, this is phenomenal news. This is this is really good. Um, it can kind of bring the player base together, or at least what's left of it. Um, but yeah, so what I'm thinking we're going to do here is I'm just going to uh, look at what the update, or not the update, what the emerge is going to entail. Um, and then I'm going to kind of mess around on my uh, Alokan just a little bit here, just because it's been a really long time since I've been on this account. Um, and our uh, our regular uh, subscriber suggested uh, videos will uh, continue in just a few days here. Anyway, let's go ahead and take a look. So, uh, this is all the details. So you can find the details on the UbiFun website. Um, but basically here on August 22nd is when this is going to take place. You can see that the, the uh, time zones and the times right here. Um, but basically, characters in the Helion server group will be automatically integrated into Trieste server. Now, um, they have some outlines here for how they're going to deal with character duplicate and, um, or like duplicate names or uh, duplicate uh, guild and alliance names. So, um, if there are no duplicate character names, the name will stay the same. Um, basically, if you have a character name that is duplicated, um, the initial of the server group H will be added to the front of the Helion character's name. And then you can change the character name from the character selection screen before logging in. So if someone else already has the name on Trieste, you don't get to have it. Um, they'll put an H in front of it and you can change it if you want to. Um, guilds are going to be a little complicated for sure. Um, basically, if a guild name created in the Helion server is a duplicate with the guild name in the Trieste server, the guild name will be changed randomly and a guild name change item will be sent to the guild master. So uh, that's really nice. So if it's the same guild... Uh, it's going to get a random name, and then the guild master will get a name change, and you guys can name it whatever you want. So, uh, yeah, that's not too bad. Um, this is all the same. I mean, there's a few there's a few more detail items here. Um, basically, if you have any items in your mailbox, uh, they're going to be deleted. So make sure there's no items in your mailbox. Um, uh, the shared storage policy and agency policy is uh, going to be kind of interesting. Uh, so basically... Um, if a shared storage is only created in the Helion group server, it'll automatically be applied to the integration of the Helion uh, server group. Um, if it already has a shared storage, the Helion shared storage will be deleted. So um, if you have items in shared storage, what you need to do is you need to move them into your normal storage, and then this won't be a problem. Um, and then any item registered in the agency will be transferred to Tristy. That's easy. Um, and then... I don't care about this part, but yeah, that's kind of the details there. So, uh, again, basically what you need to do is if you have any items, uh, that are in your shared storage, you want to make sure that you, um, move them into your normal storage and then that won't be a problem. Uh, that's like kind of the biggest takeaway that I'm getting from this, um, I'm trying to see if there's anything else to be careful with. Just basically, I would get everything out of shared storage. I'd get it out of your shop. I'd just, just kind of get everything into your normal storage and into your inventory, and everything will be completely fine. Um, if you have too many characters, um, you can view up to 14 characters at a time. Basically, what's going to happen is um, you'll have to delete characters you're not using from the list uh, if you want to see the other characters, like if you are over that 14 amount. And then, um, sorry... And then you'll be able to see those characters. So uh, you won't be able to have like 10 billion alt characters. Uh, if, if you have too many, you won't be able to see it. But it is there. You just have to delete some of the old ones. Uh, yeah, that's kind of all the 
the big stuff that I'm seeing. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm actually kind of excited for this, if I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. Uh, Helion, um, man, Helion was so fun when it came out. I absolutely loved this server. I played this server for a long time. I got a bunch of friends into it. It was fresh. It was fun. It was great. Um, but very quickly, it became apparent they weren't trying to run the server any different than they did Trieste, which is why I think it ultimately failed. Um, they didn't try to make it different. Uh, if they would have tried to make it more of a classic server or a less pay-to-win server, um, I think it would have done so much better. Uh, but they didn't take that route. They just updated it the exact same way they updated Trieste, um, and ultimately it failed. Again, I'm really not surprised. Uh, however, I'm happy that they're merging. Um, it's going to give me a chance to... Uh, kind of play on my Alokan some more because I'll be able to use my Alokan on Triesty server. Um, I, I actually put a lot of work into this Alokan, so uh, that's going to be kind of fun for me. I am definitely looking forward to that. I was like, oh yeah, I, I like kind of forgot I even had this Alokan to be completely honest with you. I was like, I was like, that's kind of fun. And I actually have some like okay stuff on the Alokan. Like I've got um, some Twilight Wings, uh, I've got a plus 10 Helion Spear. Um, I don't have a plus 10 set, but I have like a mixture of plus 7 and plus 8 set. Um, I have a bunch of Spooklets from that Spooklet event. Uh, I did farm my perp on this account. Um, I've got at least one Immortality Jade Bracelet, a V-Fun Bracelet, uh, or sorry, Belt, and then a Zudo Bracelet. And I have 9% gems in those, so that's, you know, that's decent. I did make a pure Moonstar earring thing. I have the 15th Anniversary Endem from the event. Pegasus from whatever transfer that was or something or there's some event a long time ago where you got that for free uh Karen's Nightmare um and then I have um some decent uh uh I have a decent uh PvE costume as well so uh yeah not bad um and I I have a PvP costume as well I did PvP a little bit on this account uh you know when Helion server was a little bit newer um but I have not done that in a long time. So, but I do have that costume, which is kind of fun. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I was, uh, I was just, I was just like, you know, they, they've been talking about this merge happening for a long time. And um, I'm happy that it's finally happening. I think a lot of players have been wanting it to happen. Uh, I will say though, like, it's kind of interesting. I feel like a lot of players think that this is going to be some, like, weird saving grace for Necron. Like, there's going to be all these players now, and uh, that is definitely not the case. Because <laughs> uh, those... those pl Why can't I use Spirit Bless? Uh, this is interesting. Um, uh, I, I just don't think that's going to be the case. Because, uh, you know... The game just doesn't have a lot of players right now in general. And just because they're fusing the servers, I mean, there's only, I think, I feel like there's only like a few people really that would come over from Helion and actually play on Trieste. So I don't, I don't, I don't see this significantly impacting the, uh, the population of the game. Um, what I do see it doing though, is I do see it, uh, allowing us to flood a little bit more, um, uh, items into the market in Trieste, which is kind of good. Uh, the market in Trieste right now, in my opinion, is just, like, absolutely terrible. Like, it's it's really hard to trade, buy items, sell items, all that stuff. Uh, it's just, there just isn't a lot of stuff happening. So, all of these, you know, plus 10 items and uh, uh, resources and stuff like that are going to get added in from Helion server, which I think will mess with the price of stuff for sure. Uh, but the fact that there's more items around, um, I'm kind of looking forward to that because I'm hoping it'll be a little bit easier to find some stuff that I want that I can't normally find. And uh, yeah, no, definitely, definitely looking forward to it. I think it's gonna be, I think it's gonna be a good thing uh, overall, just for the game and uh, um, for me. I, it, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, that's kind of all I got. Uh, so yeah, let me know. Um, let me know what you guys think about uh the server merge if you think the server merge is a good thing if you think it's a bad thing um if you're looking forward to playing on some you know uh, characters that you haven't touched in a long time uh or if you just don't care at all whatever it is let me know what you're thinking i uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video um and yeah like i said i'll i'll review i'll resume with my normal uh 
suggested or subscriber suggested videos uh, in like a day or two here. Um, if you haven't, make sure to check out my uh, last video before this one um, and uh, leave a comment or like a comment for the videos that you want to see. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And until next time, take care. Peace.